I was lucky to be born on the first day the smog hit Denora in October 1948. Five days later, they had to set up an emergency hospital. It's still hard to say whether I actually met my father or not. He was there when I was born. Five days later, he was in the basement of the Denora Hotel. It had been converted into a morgue. No one talked about it when I was in elementary school. When I was in high school, Congress passed the Clean Air Act. When I enrolled in nursing school, the Clean Air Act wasn't just about studying the dangers of air pollution anymore. The Clean Air Act in 1970 changed Denora. The zinc plant, which refused to shut down in 1948, was regulated. Instead of shame and silence, Denorans can talk about what has happened and what's happening. It's 1973. Red eyes that I saw as normal are clearing up. I haven't treated anyone with shortness of breath this week. No one called in sick to work this week. This means I get to spend the holidays with my son. My son and his father. <laughs>